What is the one or two services offered by the library that you can't get anywhere else in town? Well, it is pretty much the only place to meet in the community. And um, it's the only place I can get books. Um, I have to drive far away if I want to take my family out for a nice library day. So we can even walk from here, which is wonderful. You literally can go into the library with your computer. You can go in there, uh, you can have coffee and, and do your research. Students, I've, I've seen a number of uh, uh, kids go down there to do their uh, research and do uh, various papers that's new, needed for school. We have great stuff on the digital, uh, and you can go and get answers to almost everything. I'm a physical therapist, and, and you know I have a number of patients who would go to the library just to use the computer still, you know, that they just didn't have a computer at home. So there's still people out there that don't have, you know, access to computers and, and or maybe the internet at home and they rely on the library. Well, the extensive choices of books, of course, and some of the resources you can go on there and get online if you, if you don't, if your computer's not working or you don't have one. Uh, it's just a great place for all kinds of resources about the town, about the history. It is nice because you can gather there indoors, you know, yeah. whereas we don't have that space here at all. But at the library, you can gather indoors. And it would be kind of nice to have a bigger space there yeah. for larger groups to meet. Yeah. I mean, sometimes there's, uh, we want to do things and it's only, you know, 50 or 100 people and it's we can't manage that. Yeah. Outdoor, we're weather dependent. Yeah, well, <laughs> so it would be great to have a place that we could go to yeah. at the library and, and, and hold meetings or an event for um, our members or volunteers. The William Fogg Library belongs to you, and we need your support.